tweet out the stream. Yes. What is it? Twitch.tv slash 2G, 2G, 2G Gaming. Right. Please, Let's please, go. please tweet it out. We want to make this as hyped as possible. Yeah, We're man. definitely going to be bringing you premium content yeah, all man. day premium long. Premium content. All day. Ah, good. It's going to be beautiful. That's what we came here for, man. All right. So, yep. Uh, I still don't know who, what character Zero is going to use yet, but it's going to be Diddy. Okay. Okay. There we go. Going all right. Smash Bros. Here we go. Game one. Yep. I'm hip and Ouija, dude. Got I'm that. hip. I'm hip looks pumped. He yeah, looks he's excited, pumped. man. He wants this. He wants this. Okay, game one. Startersville. Let's go. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Zero off to a great start already. Yeah, man. And already, I'm just loving the spacing from Zero. Just going yeah. in automatically. Just He just definitely set the tempo right from the start. Just ran across the stage. Just grabbed Rob. He was going to try to set up with this gyro stuff initially. Right. Just didn't so let him have it. Time. Yeah. Didn't give him time to breathe, which is what you have to do against Rob. Yep. Absolutely. Ouija doing great though. I mean, he's not kind of he's not rushing in or anything, not allowing himself to get comboed. Yeah, he's just kind of staying back and kind of helping out. I'm hip when he can, but right. um, and I'm hip doing great so far too. Actually, they're they're not that too far behind. Yeah, these guys are definitely holding their own. Though. All right. <laughs> All right. Okay, good more smash. That's not gonna kill yet, but Ouija is at 97 percent. And wow, good fair. Wait, Ouija's gonna come back and. Good job by I'm hit. Protecting his teammate. Make sure he didn't get hit on his uh, Yep. Dude, red team has all the stage control in the world yeah, right now. They forced the both members of the green team to opposite sides. They couldn't yeah. get anything started. Beautiful play by Rich and Zero here. Yeah, absolutely. And usually oh. when you are playing, that's unfortunate right there. Yeah. But usually when you are playing against uh, in doubles, you uh -huh. know, you want to actually be the one who's sandwiching the other opponent. But in that kind of scenario, they had both players on their two sides of the edge, right? And you do not want to be in the corner. No, in they any were game. they were fearful. Like they they weren't in good positioning. They were they were scared for their lives. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, I'm hip actually lost his, and somehow Ouija's living at 163 percent. But yeah. it won't be long. <laughs> yeah, it won't be long at all. Yeah, this man has been hit with everything. Wow, wow, wow! Okay, okay, okay. Let's that's a little go, high. This, dude. this guy came to play, man. I'm, I'm talking about how this play. man's going to die soon. Yeah, and he's not like, nah, no, dude. I'm I, actually going to murder both yeah. of these people. Gone. <laughs> oh, my Dawn. God, dude. The yeah. ultimate commentator's curse. Yep. <laughs> wow. Yeah, beautiful, man. There. They're doing great. Absolutely. Oh, these down tilts. That's a solid damage. And because we, I mean, they're both in really uncomfortable positions or and uncomfortable presents. But yeah, despite that, because Ouija is is living, they're actually in the lead. Yeah, Rich. Oh yeah, Rich. Rich is feeding for that grab right now, dude. Yeah, that easy kill. Oh, that'll okay. do it. Okay. Yeah, pretty much anything at that point would have done it with right. any Pikmin. So, yeah. but I'm hip is going to take zero stock there, and it's three stocks of three. Pretty much a perfectly even game, with the exception of Rich, who has a little bit of percent on him. Yeah. Okay. Good side B. See anything there? And great down tilts. I love the down tilts coming out of Ouija. He's just interrupting a lot of the, the standard approach options that Rich Ryan's going for. Yep. And he's just pushing them right into I'm hip hitboxes as well. He's Gotta be honest, I don't know what's I have I don't know what just happened. For the last twenty seconds, everyone just hit everyone. Oh yeah, nobody it was just a cared. Huge yeah. It was like a prison <laughs> riot or something. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> These guys are just going ham. They just man. broke out of Smashville, man. <laughs> yeah, Alcatraz, man. <laughs> Ridiculous. Ooh, oh, that is going to do it. Oh, my ah, God. Okay. Green team it's again. They're out. in the lead. Yeah. And this is kind of what we're talking about in terms of neutral. Yeah. And one of the great things I've been seeing again from Winchy is every single time in a scramble situation, he immediately goes out the outside, and he right. just down tilt everyone into the damage. And so everyone's just getting hit, and then look at him now. The one oh on one stage with the two stocks. I'm hip just hanging back to try to cover the rolls. Yep. Uh, from there, just get it. Rich manages to put himself in an okay position. Ooh. That okay, was that was a little tech, unfortunate, yeah. yeah. Okay, good yellow forward smash. Yeah, dude, Rich is by no means out of this. Like, if he, they're both at high percent. If he can take these stocks, Ooh. and it was a one v one, I honestly think Rich could yeah. very easily bring it back. Yeah, and Luigi almost got the confirm. Gyro the dare. You you notice that he's going for um, I'm hip a lot, and I think the reason he's doing that is he doesn't want to do the Olimar ditto in a one v one. Yeah. Yeah, because see now I'm hip's gonna. I don't know if I'm hip's gonna take it, no, but I know that. I think he's gonna leave him. I think. Okay. He's gonna wow. Him. I think it's a solid play. I do think it's a okay. solid play. I think that Ouija can definitely do this. That's, That's it. it. Yeah. That's it. That's it. it. That All is right. it. Wow. Ouija, Ouija pops, pops off, off a little bit. Yeah. He pops off. Okay. Zero, Zero's okay. going to switch the sheet. And I, he, just look at him. Yeah, he knows. He knows. He's ready to go. I, he is ready to go. Yeah. I really think Ouija's going to, uh, uh, Zero's going to switch the sheet. I, yeah. I'm Great. very highly predicting that. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Yeah, but let's just take a quick recap of what just happened right there. Yeah. So I love that Ouija's patience during this entire time, and uh -huh. that just really exemplified it. So he goes in, shows the fair. And all he was trying to do, he's not even necessarily trying to hit him too much with it. He's just trying to remove all of Rich Brown's recovery options. Right. Once they're gone, all Rich can do is up B. 
Right. And he has to move around him. And of it course, was great. he just hawks him down, gets him on the clean dare. Literally nothing Rich could have done. Nothing. Yeah. Um, yeah, no. Ouija was definitely the MVP of that one. Uh, yeah. Living all the way to like, what, 190 before he finally died his yeah. first stock. And yeah, that, that gave him a huge lead and a huge momentum boost. So. Absolutely. And then that double up that air. Double up the air du okay, yeah. actually, that was even crazier. I don't know if you guys saw what happened like right before the double up air, but like he used his gyro to knock someone in to I'm hip, and then I'm hip knocked them knocked both them in back, there, and, and then, then he, he just up aired both of them. Yeah. Like, it was so Such hype, dude. Awesome. Such yeah. amazing awareness. Yeah. yeah. Game that's two. What I'm saying. That gyro, man, like, it yeah. has so many great confirms, and especially with a teammate on deck, you're going to see them get these kind of ping pong things from across the stage. I'm telling you, dude, he's the best Beyblader we have. Yep. <laughs> this side of the Mississippi. Yep. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this side of the Mississippi. <laughs> <laughs> the North Carolina coming out of yeah, me a little bit, dude. <laughs> yeah. I, had to, I had to do it. I love it. I love it. Anyways, you guys are choosing final destination. What do you think about this pick? Uh, I think that Rich Brown hasn't been touched yet, and that's pretty incredible. But yeah. I actually, I do agree. Um, uh, Ouija was camping the platform a lot and using his gyro from there and using his laser from there, and right. this doesn't give him that opportunity. Yeah. So that's going to be a big factor. Wow. Zero. Yeah, Trying to go for it again, almost gets it there. Zero, surprisingly, has the most percent on him out of everyone. Yeah. Um, with the, oh, well, I guess uh, I'm hips tied with him now. But yeah. Still, super even game. Um, Rich is doing a great job. He hasn't taken much damage at all. Yeah, absolutely. Red okay. team has a good amount of stage control right now, though. Oh, oh wow. my god, that Luigi! Was beautiful. Perfectly placed yes. back air to kill Zero. And he just slightly he just slightly let him take. He knew he had to come back, try to get a recovery, and just gets bear right at the point time. That was so Are sweet. Ouija and I'm hip are gonna take the they set off of Zero and Rich Brown? They might just go 2 0. A 20 and a handshake, though? Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, all, okay. right, all right, all right, all right. So zero go. evens it up. Keep yep. it honest. Okay, good Nair. So yep. Nair and he's gonna come back. There's the nothing. Yeah, there. Yeah. That's the. That's why one of. That's one of the reasons that matchup is so volatile and bad. Yeah. It's just because uh, Ouija has no options when he's up being. Yeah. But one of the things that is, that is gonna be dangerous for Zero, even though obviously Zero is a phenomenal player. Right. If he gets stuck in these scramble situations, he's gonna take so much damage. Yeah. And that's kind of the problem of she can double. As great as a character she is in series, yep. it's because she's able to always dictate the pace and when to go in. But when she has to deal with trades, then she's just gonna eat ton and she will die early. Rich is dominating. I'm hip. And actually, there was a moment there. Zero, Zero has been comboing Ouija for like the past 20 seconds. Yeah. And there was one moment where Rich kind of like chucked I'm hip into Zero, and he just threw one back air, and then went right back to comboing yeah. Ouija. And it was like <laughs> yeah. the most. It was such cute awareness yeah. to like do that and allow Rich to continue his strings. Yeah. And that's actually that's a solid play by them. I do think that's what they're gonna have to look at if they're gonna try to close out this game. Rich. Because they're characters that do not want to deal with traits. Right. So if they can go and get these one-on-one -on -one situations and they can wow. use their skills, then go for it. Rich is the new Ouija man. He is just not dying. Yep. Whoa! Okay. okay. I like it. What is it? What is the count right? It's four stocks to four just because Rich hasn't died. Okay, four stocks to yeah. three. Four stocks to three. Yeah. yeah. Rich is at 100. That's so scary too. He kills. I mean, Olimar is such a. That's never it. mind. Yeah. He's gone. gone. <laughs> All right. So Ouija needs to hold on to his stock, man. Everyone else is at really, really nice percents, like super safe, but. Ouija is he's playing with fire right now, fighting yeah. Zero right now. Oh, but he's gonna a lot of solid damage off. Zero. Yeah, he is. His shield, shield is looking shield, real grim. Yep. <laughs> Skills, <laughs> dude. Yeah, man. <laughs> Jelly beans. Yeah. Oh no, Ouija no, no, with the SD. No. That is super unfortunate. Yeah, I mean, no, granted, we'll it was he probably wasn't coming back yeah. just because, like I said, he has no options out of his up E because he can't air dodge. Yeah. So she can just throw out bouncing fish and it beats out all of Rob's aerials. Right. Uh, but. It's still kind of unfortunate, kind of a momentum killer. Yeah, absolutely. So hopefully he doesn't let it get to him. Okay, good down tilt. Love these down tilts, but Rich Brown's going to get the crab. It okay. doesn't get string, though. Oh, see, I'm hip? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that, that almost ended Rich oh. uh, Zero stun. I'm hip is about to... I'm hip really needs to stay alive, because if it's just down to Rob, he's just going to be combo central, man. Like, yeah. there's, there's oh, nothing he's going to yeah, be able to do. That's going to do it. This is, this is looking like it's going to a game three. Yep. But it is going to be on Green Team's counter pick, and they're probably going to pick something with a low ceiling so that um, Luigi can kill them with up airs. Yeah. Okay. Good space. But hey, man, I don't want to count this man out. Last time I last time I did that, <laughs> he, he showed me what was up. Okay, that's wow, going to do it. All yeah. right. 1-1. One, one. Another game three set, man. Yeah. We've had a lot. Yeah, I think that in that kind of situation, Luigi was trying to get away. Yeah. And he was DIing already away. And right. so Zero just go ahead and bounce the fish. Of course, it's going to be horizontal movement, and he's just going to 
snipe the life out of him. That's actually one thing I noticed about Ouija is he doesn't actually quite know how to DI in certain situations. Yeah. I think that's one that's one of the only areas that Ouija's lacking because yeah. I remember when I played him, like he DI'd in for all my nares and things like that. And right. I was able to get like free knees and stuff. So right. I think if he if he worked on learning and understanding where he should be DIing, he would be so, so good. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. So these guys discussing their counter pick now. I mean, they're, they're in a good position to take this. As you were saying before, like, we saw from game one. Yeah. It's so important to take game one mm -hmm. in any games. And now that now that they saw what really worked for Rich and Zero, given that spacing, of course, Zero didn't make the switch to Sheik. Right. But if they can even get a place where they can actually take, take advantage of those scramble situations, this potentially could be theirs. No, take. they could 100% they could do this. I yeah. have so much faith in them. They're going okay. to Dreamland. Great pick right there. Yeah. All right, let's see it, man. Game three. Yep. Who is going to take it? It's big, too. I'm sure that, like, are, I mean, maybe Zero and Rich Brown are first seed. Yeah. So, like, if, if Ouija and I may take it, that's a nice bracket for them. Yeah, but, man, that's a really clean bracket. Okay. Not to say that this doubles tournament isn't stacked as heck. I mean, yeah. <laughs> this is like Zero and Rich Brown's round two or three, probably, yep. and it's giving them problems. So <laughs> There's a ton of killers out here, man. All right, wow, yeah, they're actually doing great so far. Uh, he's just hunting zero down. <laughs> <laughs> Which is so surprising, because yeah. you would think he just would want to probably deal with Rich. Nah, he's fine. Yeah, he's fine. He's robbed, dude. Yeah. This is Smash 4. Yeah. We going nowhere. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good gyro, and I love the use of this platform. This is really voting well yeah. for Ouija. Yeah, that's why FD didn't work out. He didn't have anywhere to go. But right. now he's got these platforms to camp again. This could be bad. Yeah. Oh, he could have down aired. That yeah. would have been dirty as heck. All right. That's something I would like to see from a lot of other players in those kind of scenarios. When she does go for a of bouncing fish, yeah. you know, if they try to come up against you, you can just dare. Yeah. And at the very least, get to trade and you'll win. So everyone at a pretty high percent. Uh, Good job. I'm hip living, just barely. Okay. Good job. I hit right down tilt. Yeah, I'm hip's really looking for alive. a grab right now. It'll probably kill uh, either of them with how much rage he has. Yeah. He's got his blue Pikmin on deck. Oh, oh my I'm god! Oh uh, right yeah, back. I'm hip. Tried to even it up really quickly and grab zero, but couldn't quite get there in time. Super even game. Yeah, but zero's still on the stock, but he is at a 106 and he is cheeks. Yep. He could die in any of the scrambles or if he's got rich. Oh right. my god, the top almost saved him. Did you yeah. see that? Yeah. The gyro actually almost saved his life. So they need to take out zero stock right now. Absolutely. They need to they need to even it up and like have that mentality of like, okay, everything's fine, like everything's even. Yeah. We're keeping up with them. You don't want to let them to carry on that momentum. Definitely. Go on, that's just zero. Really zero is not giving it to them. He's staying behind Rich Brown. Rich Brown is putting up a wall of Pikmin. Yeah, I like the setup that they were doing before. They're, yeah. they're neutral. Just going in, like you said, put the wall of Pikmin, use the needles when necessary, and then he dictates spacing. And that's I, what she thrives at. Yep. Being able to know when to go in so you don't have to deal with trades. I'm hip was fishing just a little too much for those kill moves, and he has eaten a yeah, huge and, and punish and for it, man. A fish, man. He, he caught this fish. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Okay, okay. The gyro? Okay, I'm hip living, barely. Oh, the snipe the gyro. Yeah, they cannot kill zero. This is going to be a huge factor in it. Finally getting it off. Yep. And that is going to... Oh my god, the save! That would have killed... That would have killed Rich. Zero coming in with a clutch save there. That might actually, like... Yeah, that might be the play That the might be the game, yeah. yeah. Okay, but this is still... It's yeah, they just need to kill Rich, like... And I'm hip needs to stay alive and use his rage to his advantage. Right. Yeah, so right now, guys, we have four stocks, two, three. And as long as we didn't take too much damage, had a white Pikmin on him. Right. And then Zero gets some Rich taking that last in. stock from I'm Hip, and now it's two stocks to four. Oh, Not looking there. good, man. Yeah. Okay, that's not gonna work. Rich Brown is gonna return safely, and Zero just gets so Zero, much yeah. On Zero is running away with his set. Yeah, he's not allowing him to get anything here. Well, doesn't go for bouncing fish, but as long as he gets stage control, he gets the again. gyro and yep. just goes right back. Uh, not really sure what happened there, yeah. <laughs> but Rich situation. Brown lost the stock. Yep. Um, Ouija is dangerously close. I actually agree oh, with him. It. Yeah. I agree with him doing it simply because like Sheik would have died if he would have landed it, and yeah. it would have been a huge momentum shift. And like with the percentage he was at, I think it was necessary. Yeah. Uh, I think it was kind of like their last. That's just ever. <laughs> okay. He's got his All right, zero. <laughs> yeah. He's just hitting everybody. Now. I know you don't like Olimar, yeah. but like <laughs> <laughs> the guy is on your team. Oh yeah, hitting him with the needles. Area. I'm hip. I mean, this is this is so hard to do. 
Yeah, and the weight. Good, good tech. Like, he's, he's yeah. staying in oh, there, wow. but. Wow, yeah. Wow, good play right there. There's hardly anything he can do. I mean, he has to play so safe. He can't throw out forward smashes. He can't really throw out grabs. Yeah, any chance, any opportunity that he has to go for some kind of kill, Zero's going to be right there to right. clean up. And he is at 151, so pretty much anything is going to kill at this point. And they know it. They're just yep. letting him do whatever he wants, staying, yeah. uh, staying around him. Yeah, the only thing right now for a red team to lose is if they end up killing themselves. Yep. Oh, is that it? Double jab. That is oh, not later quite percent. it. Wow, yeah. Rich going super deep. Yeah. He wants to spike. He wants some glory. That, that Nair's going to do it. All right. Yeah. Good stuff to Ouija. And uh, uh, I'm hip, though. That yeah. was, I mean, really gave them a run for their money. That was a super good set. Great plays. Great plays. <laughs> that game one was so hype. Yeah. But Zero and uh, Rich Brown just made all the adjustments that they needed. Yeah. Is this a three out of five? Wait. What's going on? Is this three out of five? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> they were just so shocked and playing them yeah, right now. They, <laughs> they, they thought they were in winners' finals already. <laughs> yeah, it's like okay, but that was not the case. Whew.